You guys are gross. Why would you do that? You guys are so gross. Stop. Okay. Oh. Oh, all right. It's a medium, so that's good. That is my size. Oh, here's the hard part. Okay. Can I have a shoulder? Thank you so much. Oh, great posture, by the way. Yes. Oh, this is very restricting. Oh, oh, my crown fell off. Jesus Christ, I make the worst mermaid ever. <clears throat> okay, well, if I was a mermaid, to be honest, well, first of all, I wouldn't, this would be closed, right? Because mermaids don't have feet. What's that noise? There's a bird in here? There's this, we are under the sea, y'all. Are you gonna snap a photo? All right, so this is the mermaid that's more moody and brooding in her relationship with a mer merman, a merman, merman. Uh, it, didn't, it, it didn't pan out, and so she's brooding now under a oyster. This is the mermaid that all her friends are like, you cannot stand up vertically. And she's like, oh, oh yes I can. <laughs> she's straining, she's struggling. This is a big role model comedy idol of mine. Steve Urkel. He was my favorite growing up. When he stepped into that time machine, he becomes Stefan, and Laura all of a sudden is into him. But you know, because I, I get it, because he's very clumsy. He was very clumsy, and he would come in, and Carl would get so mad. I love you, Urkel. I mean, how can how can we not? I love when um, you know, kind of heartthrobs hold uh, animals. I'm reminded of that David Hasselhoff uh, shoot with the Sharpays. I love you, JTT. You're the best. Okay, here we go. Okay, these guys, wow, 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 wow. I was obsessed. I remember this guy for some reason. This one in the back, the blonde, this blonde guy right here. Beverly Hills 91340. I gotta throw up some brandy for sure. Major fixture in all of our lives, the boy is mine. Did brandy. I loved this era of Leo, the, the Romeo and Juliet era with Claire Danes. I love this, I love, I love you, Leo. Can I give him a sniff or is that not allowed? Okay. This one, it's like, it's like Odie, like an oatmeal, like grandpa's oatmeal. Milk chocolate. Okay, well, that's what that is. This one also with a bit of oat. Okay, I'm just gonna dab it. Um, I feel like this is the same flavor as the other one. Okay, so if that one's milk chocolate, let's call this one Oreo chocolate. That's a graham cracker. That is not a graham cracker. That's interesting that that's how they, that you communicate a graham cracker. Uh, I mean, it's it's like a wild world of, of lips. Okay, here we go. Oh, what, what? What is this? I'm sorry, but it smells like garlic. Who would want to put that? Who would want? I don't. I don't Okay, let's say a rotisserie chicken. Ew, y'all are gross, dude. You guys are so gross, stop. Ew, it's called pizza pie. That's crazy, you guys are crazy. <laughs> Who does, I'm still grossed out by that. I'm, I'm actually, I can't believe that just happened. Oh God. <laughs> Knowing that this could take a wrong turn like at any time now, oh no, oh hell no. Oh no, what is, I don't wanna put, oh no, what is this? Bacon bomb, ew, you guys are so gross, stop. Why would you do this? Again, and look at that bacon, it's so happy. Are these real? Who sells these, Spencer's? What else did y'all have in here? Oh my, sriracha, are you kidding me? Oh, dill pickle. Dill Pickle. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's very upsetting. I am very upset. Felt and, hold on. Oh, I got some foundation on it. Oh, it comes off in that round. First of all, a lot of weight in here. I feel like when you do a crystal ball reading, you they don't actually touch it because then they have to fabuloso it. So. I feel like in my future, it's gonna be um, cold and dull because that's how this feels like. That's what this, but that also could be great because I won't be 
sweating. I don't know what it's telling me, but I'll tell, I'll tell it that I hope that the future is good. I get, yeah, that's, yeah, that's good. 30 seconds. I, I'm so started already. Can I use my mouth? <laughs> I know that, my mouth doesn't even work. My mouth doesn't even, oh yeah, okay. All right. No, oh, oh, oh! And that is not as cool as tying like a cherry thing with your mouth, but um, not as hot, I guess. But still a, a skill. All right. And then I just go around it. Okay. This is weird. Okay. This is a weird thing. Three times. Is this three yet? Dip. What? Faster? I thought it was three times. I went around like six. I'm, I'm dizzy now. Hit the ball. <laughs> I said, I did it. Yeah, yeah. It worked out. Because of the color, and also because of, I think, the confidence and the kind of like yes queenness of it, I would call it Pepto Bitch Mall. Okay. Right here, this is a probably, this is one of your deeper reds. I would call this blood. I, 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 that's a bad lipstick name. That's a really bad lipstick name. But we could spell it fun, like B-L-U-D. Um, this one, this kind of reminds you of that, of that palette, um, like the, the one, the palette that everyone likes, the naked palette, where everything's kind of, um, you know, like, um, uh, like uh, earthy, maybe like a little nudie. So I'm gonna call this nudie. See, this is one of those lipsticks that's like, it incorporates kind of an orange into it. Well, actually, no, this one's more, this one actually isn't. I'm gonna name, I'm gonna name this Delilah. I, Del, De, um, sorry, not um, Michael. This one will be named Michael. And I'll tell you why. Because it's, Michael is a ubiquitous name. There's a lot of people named Michael. However, you can, there's every, all, it's, oh, that's okay. Michael. Oh, this is so pretty. I'm sorry, I don't want to offend her, but her natural born cowlicks are not very, um, they don't really lend itself to the kind of bangs that I want to do. Okay, here we go. How was your day today? Yeah, last night I fell down all of the stairs and... <laughs> oh, that's cute, how, how was Tampa? <laughs> oh my God, I missed, I'm sorry. <laughs> No, 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 There we go. Do you fly out of LaGuardia or JFK? I actually don't mind Newark. You know, it's like the drive, I listen to my podcasts, I do my thing. <laughs> Here, let me just take some weight out of the back. Sorry, you have a lot of hair, I'll tell you that. All right, I, got, I gave you some layers in the back so that when it grows back, it'll, it'll grow back real natural. I would say uh, definitely use that head and shoulders and you should be good. But do you like product? Do you mind product? Which product do you like hate? Because I have those only. <laughs> okay. If you can Venmo me, that would be sick because actually we, our credit card machine's broken. You like it? I love it. <laughs> Super cute. Oh, I love this. I used to watch these commercials. That's my arches. They always teach you in school to make the eyes kind of like a mouth. I didn't, do, I didn't actually listen to that. I don't even know what I'm listening. My mouth is bigger than that. There's, th these are teeth. That's, that's the Invisalign. And then I have a little blush, natural blush. And I do have a side part, so. And sometimes my ears are out there.
I have these available in print on Etsy. So far, no one's bought one. And there was an Amazon comment that said that those shoes look like a loaf of bread. I resent that. It's not absolutely not a loaf of bread. That is a shoe.